Has your professor recommended that you read articles written by a particular author? Do you see the name of a particular scholar showing up frequently in the articles relevant to your research? If so, you might want to broaden your search beyond subject searching and look for articles written by that particular author. Let's imagine that your professor has recommended that you read articles by Yvonne Yezbek Haddad. Let's use Index Islamicus to find some more written by her. Most databases give two options to search for authors. You could simply click the drop-down menu and change it to author. Notice that when we do this, we are given a new option, look up authors. We will return to this option in a moment. For now, let's simply type in Yvonne Yazbek Haddad. In some databases, you might want to type in the author's last name first, but in this one, you could just go ahead and type in the name starting with the first name. We get 33 results. You'll notice that her name is listed in all of the results as either a sole or co-author. Before we browse these articles, let's go back and look at the second option. This time we will click the Look Up Authors link. Why would we bother taking this extra step? The main reason is that sometimes authors will change their name a bit, particularly by the use of initials rather than their full names. This time, let's type in her last name, Haddad, and her first initial, the letter Y. Notice that all of the names are added using or so the database will display them all. In this case, we see that Yvonne Yezbek Haddad also uses her initials, so we can get more. Sometimes there will be a first initial, sometimes her last initial. You can add as many as you would like. Some of these could conceivably be other authors, but that's okay. When you browse the results, you will see that the titles of those articles will reflect different areas of research that she does not work in, and they can be safely ignored. Once you retrieve your results, you can browse the page. If you only want the newest articles, or articles from a particular date or time period, you could refine either by entering a specific date or dragging along the timeline. For instance, we could limit the timeline to just the articles that she wrote in the 1990s. Perhaps these might reflect a certain period of interest. So now we've isolated her articles to just this one period. As always, if you need additional assistance, feel free to stop by the reference and research desk at the library, phone, or contact us by online chat.